All right, I got my big, big reds with me. I'm going to see if I can catch something out of this city duck pond. I do know there's trout in here. They stalked them back in March. And a couple of weeks ago, they stalked channel catfish in here. So who knows what I might catch. And these are really big, big reds from my worm bin, which I talked about in my previous video. Big red worms are more hardy than night crawlers. I don't even need to keep them on ice. And these are big enough to fit on my hook really well. And I just got a size two bait boss hook, a little split shot directly on my line. And I have the hook exposed because if you want to hook fish, the hook needs to be exposed. Same setup on this one. The only difference between these two combos is one has six pound line and the other has eight pound line. I think this is the one with six pound line. Here we go. Another one rigged up. Now, it's a matter of waiting to see what bites. First bite of the day, missed it. Maybe whatever it was will come back. Got him right in the corner of the mouth. He broke the line. But nice little carp. It's almost bait size. I'd almost use this guy to try to catch flatheads with. However, I'm going to put him back in the water. Really cool. I wasn't really expecting to catch a carp. I was hoping for trout or a channel cat. Now I gotta re-rig my hook. I think that's the smallest carp I've ever caught on this channel. Right, here it is rigged up again. Let's see what I catch. Now I wanna say most of the fish are probably around the duck feeder here. 
and I've seen people feeding the ducks and the geese all day long. It's better to use the food out of this machine than to use like bread because bread kills ducks. And I want to show you guys a really unusual pairing between a mallard and a white duck. Now, I think that's a mallard, right? The one on the right there, the colored one is a male and the one on the left there is a female. And if I go down here, there is a male mallard paired with a white duck. I don't know what the white duck is, but I've been seeing him swim around this entire pond and he's very protective of his gal. Like this, this might be a crossbreed mallard right there. He's chased him away. He's chased some of the other white ducks away and they've just been swimming together the whole time. Really interesting thing to see. There's a lot of different ducks here and he decided not to go with uh, another mallard as his mate. Canadian geese that should be up north in Canada. Yeah, 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 hiss at me. <laughs> Hopefully I'll get another fish today. it's been a couple hours actually it's been about three hours and nothing i don't think any of the fish are going to bite it's really really slow i might have to catch it right after they stock the pond with catfish in the future or trout anyway i thought it was a good idea to take my big big red to this pond to see what i catch and i caught a little bitty carp probably the smallest carp i've caught so far and to me that was a really cool fish to catch i really do hope you enjoyed this video and as always i want to thank you for taking your time out of your day to watch the video i really really appreciate it and if you don't mind me fishing ponds please hit that thumbs up thanks again for watching hope to see you next time